welcome back to Let's Build Hogwarts, part 71, 71, 71, bingo. <laughs> okay, so today we are going to finish this wooden bridge, most definitely. It has taken a little bit longer than I thought it would, but it will get finished. And we are also going to do the landscaping down to Hagrid's. I do hope to get all that done too. That is a lot more straightforward than you think because there's no detailing. We don't detail that side because it's not a rocky cliff edge down to Hagrid's. Whether we'll actually get to Hagrid's today is another matter. I doubt it to be fair. So next week will be Hagrid's. Uh, finish a few bits off around that way and then the week after we'll be back to the front of Hogwarts and we'll be working on the other side of the castle at long last. So two more episodes on this side including today and over to the other side. So for our equipment today we're going to need hopefully get to finally use the polished deep slate. I've been saying this for a couple of weeks now we just never get round to it. We're also going to want the polished deep slate slabs uh, the polished deep slate wall. Uh, going to need some stone bricks and some stone brick wall ba -ba 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 -ba. and some grass blocks. Some bone meal and I can't see us getting any further than that today so we'll leave it there for now I'll see how we get on. So I noticed during editing I missed a pillar here so this needs to come down to the same height. Okay so first things first it is fairly straightforward and um, my toddler is up, uh, so as you can probably hear, my toddler is about today, uh, so we're having to record these quite early on now, uh, I can't do them at night, and so he's going to be about making a little bit of noise. Okay, we're also going to need some spruce fences just in case because you can see me knocking a few of those out by accident oops there we go okie dokie so we're going to start off with our polished deep slate and first things first we're just going to go and put one on top of every block like so So this roof is going to be very similar to the way I do the other roofs, the roofs to the quad in particular, only we're going one block high and not two. So I'll fast forward now, so we're just going to put one on the top of every block all the way down and one on the other side too. So I shall see you in a few.
all we're gonna do is come up and one, knock out the bottom. Just follow the line as best you can when it comes to the ups and the downs. Okay, so if we knock out the excess there, it will change here. So we're still knocking off the excess, but we're going up one from there so knock out the one underneath because that's now excess too keep going knock off the excess where it starts doubling up could go from there mm -hmm. where I think we'll go from there and knock off the ones underneath Okay, so I'll knock off the excess. down got the access and where it starts there that way if we have the hole Then it's straightforward all the way to the end. Don't worry about the little stone building that we've got at the end, we'll get to that after we've done the roof. And that's one way you done. So now we're going to do the same on the other side. Work it up a layer at a time on each side. Don't go up two or three and then do this side. Try and stick to one side at a time. Because that's where mistakes happen. Access there. And then where have I gone up there? We need to make sure that you stick go up on the same side, same block on each side, otherwise you're not going to be even in the middle. So 
So what we'll do is we'll tackle the ups first. So let's knock off our excess. Because then we can fast forward the end bit. So we're just doing that as a guide to show we've got going up at the same place. coming down. We'll get to that in a moment. Oh, that's it. Okay, so we're gonna go up again. We can choose which one this time. Mm. I think we'll go there. Hopefully, step it up there. Same route. Oh. 
that there for now because we've got to tackle the downs in a bit. access first. fairly straightforward now to the end. So we'll come back and tackle those. That's just straightforward. So we'll be able to fast forward that bit. So let's continue on with this side. Knock off the excess. Find where you see daylight. Mm-hmm. 
Where is that one? Other? Other. Hmm. I feel I've done something wrong here. Oh, okay, we didn't do. That's me telling you to do one side at a time, and there I go and did make the mistake. layers on there so we need to bring this one out nope that's not right either is it oh dear there we go thought I messed it up completely though Access. Find where you see daylight, it should be what? Oh, okay, I've already done that. Okay, getting confused.
<laughs> okay. I'm hoping that made sense. <laughs> I plan to have to wing it a little because I lost my rhythm. So the rest of it is pretty straightforward now. It's not a very tall roof. I meant to pass forward this bit. Never mind, it's not taking that long. Again, we'll tackle that bit at the end. We'll do that last. Okay, so that's our roof done. Almost. We want the deep slate slabs. We're going to put those on the edges like so. to have a knocked one out by mistake. Okay. Oops. Well, let's see on the other side. So put one there. 
な。Radio. So we've just got a couple of windows to put in. We're going to need some lanterns. I forgot about the lanterns. Start at this end, see now we're already here. And we're just going to pour in a lantern every so often. I'm not counting, I'm just putting them where I feel is needed. next I think it's just the windows and this bridge is done okay so we need to find our middle block again Also going to need some black glass paint. Done with the lanterns. Where's our middle gun? It is there. I'd say the middle is in the middle of that, which is roughly where we are anyway. So we're going to come up. Let's just place a marker there. Alrighty. So we're going to knock those out and replace those with the bricks. Same on the other side. I'm going to put some black paint there. Black paint there. Oh, are those steps? There. Okay. So we're going to need some polished deep slate. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
get rid of the flat there because I think we're done with ours now. No, we're not. Okay, we need those back. Polished deep slate. Um, I think we're done with the fence. Put one on top there. again. So I'm going to go around the middle. Again. Deep slit. And then the what? There we go. I didn't mess it up after all. Thought I had. So that's our main window. So we've got two more windows to put in either side. Do we count or do we not? Or do we just put them in where we want? I think I'm going to put one in there. So we're following that line there. And then we're going to put one in the middle of those two. Like that. They look evenly spaced, so we're not going to count, but we're just going to spread them out a little bit. So we'll go off to this one first. Okay, I've not finished that over there. Never mind, we'll come back for that. So we're going to knock out that one. We're going to put a stair on top of those two, like so. And then a stair around the top bits there, so we can knock those two out too. Fence. We do need the fence back after all. So spruce fence. We'll get rid of the bone mill because we won't need that to last anyway. Put one bit of fence in there. Mm. Would black glass block not be better? It would. Okay. I'm going to come over to this way and knock out that piece and those two. So we're going to add a fence there. Oops. We're going to put them 
black glass there. That way. And that way. There we go. Okay, so same again underneath this one too. I'm going to head for that one being our middle. Take out those. Put in an extra fence, but not there. Black glass. Stairs. There we go. Okay, so we want to do the same on this side, so we're going to space out two windows over here. So I'm thinking that line there, and another one over there. That looks nicely spread out. glass Look those two out stir stir okay same over here take that one out and that one out and those two black glass Two windows down, so that side looks great. So let's go do the other side. So we're gonna so it's on top of this one. Bottom of this one. There we go, our bridge is complete. Our bridge looks good. I'm very happy with our bridge. Our bridge looks very impressive if you ask me. Okay, what are we up to time wise? Because I forgot to make note of the time. 50 minutes for me. It could be a little bit, yes, less for you, but not much. Call it five minutes. We're probably going to go over time today. Because I really want to get the, Hag the landscape and out of Hagrid's good and truly started. Although, to be fair, a lot of that is probably going to be fast forwarded. Yeah, it all looks the same, so that will probably get fast forwarded. 
Never mind. So, okay, let's go and have a look at this edge then. So how many have we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Right. Zoom. So we want to bring these stone bits that we've got here to a total of seven. So let's just fill in our gaps there. So we have one, two, three, and four. So we need five, six, and seven. So just add three on top. How do I tackle the roof? We just bring it in. Just bring it in until it meets the wall. So this is going to go all the way across to the edge. Okay, we're gonna need our slabs. Did I put one there? Uh, oh, I kind of did. Right, oops, throwing things again. So, what we do with that one is that goes all the way across. What have I done wrong here? So this isn't looking right. Would help if I could see to turn on the lights. Okay, so let's knock off those slabs. Let's knock that bit off there too. Okay, so that appears to have appear to have brought that in a bit there. There we go. Could always put So it's fading out. Right. We now need some spruce planks and some spruce stones. What have I used? Spruce planks and stone brick stairs. Spruce planks. 
we're done with all the deep slate now and stop upstairs. So I'm just going to take all this out the middle here. Then we're going to need some spruce stairs too. Place this. Oh, I see what I've done. Right, okay, so that's why it's not matching up. Oi. Okay, let's not look back a bit more. There we go. So I'm going to come in and then we're going to knock out this third row here one block above to one block below and we're going to add in stone brick wall there same over here third block third row now the bridge is complete So we have got a stone circle out here, which we'll do that next time with Hagrid's and the path that comes down to Hagrid's, which we'll also do next time with Hagrid's. But for now, I would very much like to get this landscaping down to there. It's all the same, so it's not a case of different heights and different widths on each level. So I just need to double check my heights. How high, low are we going to take this? So this is on level 28. down 36 36 so we're gonna bring it down okay so we are on level 28 here and our height here uh, wrong way So that was 28 and we're now at 79. So we're on 79. Sorry, I'm having to deal with my little one, so I'm probably a bit of cuts here. So if it's not quite making sense, that's why. 
um, oh, I have missed that, I've not got that right. So it's 28, and we're now on 79. That's better. So we're going to bring it down 40 blocks. So 78. So we're still going to come down. 40 blocks so we're on 78 so we want to go until 38 um, yes sorry <laughs> you know what I'm like for math right, so we want to br keep bringing this down until we get to level 38 which is down here so it's a similar level to there if you want to, so there's, there's no right and wrong with this, so if you want to bring it down lower, you can. If you don't want to bring it down as low, you don't have to. Billy, on yours, I would bring yours down until it meets your natural land. So I think there will be about an extra 10 to 15 blocks for you on top of the 40, but I would bring yours down until it meets your natural landscape. All we're going to do is it's just that. So what we started on, so 38 we wanted to go to. Same again. So I'm going to fast forward this now. So just keep doing this until you get to level 38. Your numbers might be different. Um, cause mine's pre update, went before they lowered and raised all the levels, so your number might be different. So just bring it down 40 blocks. Because I think for you, your bottom starts at minus 60, I think. For me, it's four. So yours is gonna be different, because mine was before, I started this before the updates. For some reason, I didn't update it with the update kind of wish I had because it would make things like this a little bit easier because then it will all match you guys so but you just bring it down 40 blocks so whatever your top number says just take away 40 okay gonna fast forward this now see you in a few
Okay, so hopefully you get the idea by now. We're just going to take that down to level 38 on mine, 40 for you guys. I'm going to cut this rather than fast forward it. Because uh, it's just going to make things a lot easier when it comes to upload timing and stuff like that. Um, so next time you see this, it'll be done. Okay, and there we have it. What I'm doing here, I've just left a little bit so I can show you. Um, we're just going over with some bone meal. Like so. It gives it a nice, untidy, weedy appearance because this section is a little on the untidy side. And then we're taking out all the flowers, leaving behind the grass and the ferns. You can, of course, just go over with grass and ferns, but I do like the way the, the randomness of the bone meal. It just gives it a little bit more natural. So, like that, and like that. Oops, see, I've done that so many times. Okay, and last one. Just like so. And then take out the flowers, unless you really want to have the flowers in there. There's no reason why you can't have them. To me, it's just a bit of a weedy, unkempt bit of hillside. I suppose you could have wild flowers, which is essentially what these are, aren't they? There we go. Well done for today. We have actually done quite a bit in there today though. So next week, obviously, as you can see, we've still got a lot more landscaping to do. And that's just on this side of the castle. There's more on our side. Um, but we will. We'll start making our way. I've said it before, but I'll try and... 10 minutes at the end of every episode we'll try and do a little bit um we'll see how that works out it never seems to work out for us does it but we'll see so next week we are going to get in hagrid's for certain there will be a little, little bad landscaping in because we're going to have to create some flat land for hagrid's to go on to um but that won't take long especially with the fast forward it's just a case of telling you how far to come out by i, I don't know off the top of my head so we will do Hagrid's next time. We will also get our stone circle up and we'll get the path down to Hagrid's. The rest can wait for landscaping. We will hopefully get all of that done next week, which means the week after we can start on the viaduct bridge. We can get rid of those now. We don't need those markers anymore. Go, but I think we're looking pretty darn good. See, and then but this is going to come out a bit more later, and then it's going to go up towards the Almory. Yeah, I quite like that. It's coming together quite nicely. So that's it for me for this week. Next week, have it. So there's no streams at the moment. I am on holiday. I will be in sunny Scotland. Maybe on a boat, trying to see some dolphins, maybe. We'll see. Um, so there's no streams for two weeks. And But I do still have access to the Discord server. So if you have any questions at all, come check us out on our Discord server. The link is in the description below along with links to the Hogsmeade train station and the Dermstrang ship that you can see there. And I think that's it for me. So until next time, guys, take care of yourselves, like and subscribe. <laughs>